Namaste. Today, Yumi wanted to show around her arms, so we are with her, we three together. It's a very lovely morning to explore Kathmandu. It's 6 May 2024, Monday. Hope we will have a wonderful time together. We are currently walking to get some souvenir for Yumi. She wants to buy a few things, so we are still shopping. We are on the way to Kathmandu Darbar Square. Very older houses here. I don't know what kind of jewelry she would like. We are still shopping for her. Such houses also interested her. She reminds me of my sister and mother. Like she saw Yumi, so Yumi means maze, and she wanted to grab it. So it's only 30 rupees here, it's boiled one. Now we keep walking. So Yumi is her name and she is having Yumi. How is it good? Yumi is eating Yumi. Funny. Well, we arrived to Asan Bazaar Chok here. It's always pleasing to be here. We are currently at Janam Bahao. Yumi is my tour guide for today. Alright, carry Ladu or Modak always in front of Ganesha temple. We arrived at Akash Varva Chok. We are currently inside Akash Varva temple here. They are very interested to learn about uh, Nepali culture and tradition, so I'm showing them around. So it's one of a form of Vairava, form of Shiva among 64 forms of Vairava. She is also looking around. They look very pretty with the Tika. I feel very blessed to be here with them. Currently inside Kathmandu Darbar Square. Very cute kids. Namaste. We are returning back to town. After escorting my Chinese friend back to the accommodation, I am super happy to meet the most handsome guy from USA here. Please uh, introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Nick. I'm from California, in San Francisco Bay Area. I like your na name. Nice to meet you, Mr. Nick Johnson. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers.
Absolutely. Here's to a good tour. Thank you, bud. Looking forward to experiencing some very tasty food in this very beautiful country. I'm glad to know you are almost a local. So, which food did you try? Um, I've had I've had momos. I've had sadiku. Uh, uh, YY chicken sadiku, oh, which wow. I liked. It was a little spicy. I tried that in Pokhara. Yeah. Um, I had the momos a few times. When I was up in the high Himalayas, I tried the yak. The cheese. yak cheese. Yeah. Uh, the yak meat was a little tough and gristly, um, but an interesting experience nonetheless. Um, Dalvat. Dalvat. Yes, I had a <laughs> decent amount of Dalvat uh, hiking the Annapurna circuit. Yeah. Um, got a little tired <laughs> towards the end. Um, but I can appreciate how simple it is and how uh, yeah. uh, uh, nutritional it is. Thank you, yeah. thank you very much and hope you will have a wonderful journey wherever you travel. Oh, thank you, I look forward to it. Good time, good time and yes. he is having momo here. How really are you enjoying, feeling? really enjoying these uh, steamed momos. Momo cheers. cheers. Momo cheers. <laughs> We are currently walking to a vegetarian garden now. It's very interesting to be with this very interesting man. How are you feeling? I'm feeling great. Enjoying the walk, learning about the wonderful cuisine of the park. <laughs> great to know. Here we are in vegetarian garden and he already had Chow Chow Sadeko is part two yes, from yes. him. Yep, yep. I've had uh, the YY. Uh, Chicken sadiku. Yeah. I've had alu uh, sadiku. Yeah. Um, and this is my first one having this one, which is actually very good. It's not too spicy, I'm and I really like know. that it's made with vegetables from the local garden here. I'm glad to know. So you had and it for has the a nice first time to it. in Pokhara, right? Yeah, in Pokhara is the first time that I, that, that I had it. It's lusty time now. How are you feeling? Oh, feeling great. Feeling great. I'm loving this. It has a great. Uh, Smooth, sweet taste to it. I'm glad I like to the cashews. Know. Have you had lassi before? Not in Nepal. This is my first Nepalese lassi. Glad to know. I'm really enjoying it. Yeah. Good job, Nepal. It's still roti time. How are you feeling? I'm uh, feeling good. It's sweet? Not too sweet. Not too sweet. Have you had this before? This one I have not had before. I've had a couple of the other little street foods, but this is the first one I've having Seru roti. Okay. Okay. Glad to know. It's time for samosa, zeri, and masala milk tea. Ah, oh, it's very good. Uh, first time I had this one was at the hot springs in Tatopani. Yeah. Uh, there was a guy that was making both these. Yeah. So how was it? It was good. Of course, at the time, he didn't really have the ability to explain to me what it was. Yeah. Um, so now it's nice to see it again and have somebody uh, explain to me exactly what it's made out of, what its significance is. Um, Thank you. And all those details. Thank you very much. So um, solid good to know you are happy. Yes, I love both. We are currently in the smallest restaurant in Kathmandu and this local American Nepali guy is trying Pani Puri. There we go. In I got one my go. mango ready right here. <laughs> I've been told. You are so daring to try this spicy food. You liked it? Glad to know. Is it not spicy yet? Okay. Is it going to get spicy? Yeah, it will be spicy with the spicy water. And here we have very cute kid called Samia. Mm -hmm. I love kids. Kids are great. So okay. now, with the spicy water. So now this is about to rock my world, yeah. right? I hope you... I let you do it, since I don't know how much I should be adding. <laughs> it should be on the top. Like that? Yeah. Okay, it's good? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Here it goes. Mmm! How do you prefer? I like it with the spicy water. I dig it. <laughs> I okay. dig it. You can go. Up to you. You can have this with the spicy water. Okay, here we go. So I fill it up to the top. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> mm. 
So he really wanted to have this yeah, in the beginning. Mm hmm. <laughs> yeah. Really good. Glad to know. So cute kid enjoying chatpati, spicy. Namaste. He is a local. How are you? I'm doing amazing. Om Mane Padme Hum. Om Mane Padme Hum. Om Mane. It's very interesting to see someone very interested in Nepali culture and history. We are in a Tibetan Nepali restaurant and this American Nepali guy is having chicken tantuk. How are you? Uh, doing very good. Uh, love the noodles there. They're nice and big and hand hold and thick. Yeah. Yeah. Have you heard something similar before? Um, I've had tukpa, but I have uh, not had this one before. Where did you have tukpa? Uh, I had tukpa when I was uh, hiking the Annapurna circuit at a couple different tea houses. Oh wow. Uh, I think I had it three times. Um, my favorite was the first time because yeah. it had this like really creamy sort of sauce, which I really liked. I'm glad to know. How was Anapuna, by the way? Amazing, amazing. It's the, the best time views. to trek. Yes, yes. The most beautiful views of one of the most beautiful mountain ranges in the world. Glad so, to know. Really enjoyed it. A scandalized dinner once again, blackout in Kathmandu because it's raining outside, lightning as well. How are you? I'm doing good. Yeah, this is all part of the experience. Uh, yeah. Getting to have some uh, great food under candlelight. It's second experience here for me with the yeah, candlelight yeah. and the foreigner. This, this is what happens. Yeah. It was really super interesting to spend time with this very handsome American guys. I'm super thankful to you for visiting Nepal again, Daniel. Hope you will have a wonderful time wherever you go. Thank you very much to all of you for watching my videos as well. It was really interesting time with my Chinese friends and also with him. See you in the next video. Bye bye. Tata. Subaratri is the word for good time. Subaratri? Subaratri. Subaratri.